Triad Traffic Trouble, sponsored by Tatum and Atkinson. Call 1-800-LAW-0804. As the weather gets warmer, it means more and more people are on the roads, including motorcyclists. But with that larger number of drivers means a bigger potential for crashes or other dangerous incidents. It's about paying attention, um, having a focus on your surroundings, not on yourself. Motorcycles are some of the easiest vehicles to miss on the road, which means those riders are especially prone to danger. Not a lot of motorcycles are on the road per percentage wise. Only 3% of vehicles moving at any one in time are a motorcycle, but over 13% of the fatalities on the roads are motorcycle accidents. According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, more than 6,000 motorcyclists were killed in traffic crashes in 2022. While there's many reasons for these crashes, one of the biggest is a simple one. Sometimes we forget about motorcyclists. Um, you have slogans like, look twice, save a life for a reason. Uh, those drivers just aren't looking for them. That's why Motorcycle Safety Awareness Month exists. The national campaign has two goals. First, to help riders know what to be aware of. Drive like no one can see you. Drive like you're invisible and they can't see you at all. So you have to be extra precautious if you're going to be passing a vehicle or you see a vehicle about to pull out. And you just have to assume that they can't see you. They do not know you're there. And second, to remind drivers to be aware of their surroundings look for motorcycles. Expect them to be on the roadway with you and you need to check your blind spots more often. Anticipate that they'll be there. And while May is focused on motorcycles, the ultimate goal is for everyone on the road to be safe. If we all come together as a community and we're looking out for each other, the roads will become safer. If you know of a troubled roadway you would like us to investigate, just email us at trafficktips at abc45.com. We'll air your concerns every Tuesday evening. In the Triad, I'm Casey Zanowick, ABC 45 News, standing up for you.